Hey guys, you're watching Boondocking with Dennis. Got up early today. It was sunny. Then we got some high winds and uh, cloud cover. And then the sun came out again. Still a little breezy. Not a bad day. Just going through downtown Rockport, Texas. I'm heading over to the Bahia Marina in Ingleside on the Bay. My buddy Mike from Leander had found it online and suggested it as a place to go check out and Mike makes good suggestions. I have been there before but I don't think I've ever videotaped there. Videotaped? Kids videotapes are uh, VHS cassettes that we used to use back in the day. <laughs> That's kind of a older term, huh? Videotaped. I guess it's recorded now. I don't know. I'm old. Get off my lawn. We pass through Aransas Pass. Maybe that's why they call it Aransas Pass. And uh, just past the spot where a few weeks ago I did the video where the bodies were found in the car. Two gentlemen were murdered. If you guys haven't heard anything about that, the last I heard was there was a person who fled to Maryland and they were brought back. I don't know if they had evidence against that person or if he was just a suspect, but I haven't seen anything about it online give you any additional information. We've done quite a few videos from these side roads back here that lead back to uh, industrial areas. And we're going to go up here to 1069 in Ingleside. Kind of just going by the old Navy base here in Ingleside. going to go up to, I believe it was Woodhaven Drive, and then turn down there, not too far up. So my phone app has me going down this little residential street, Woodhaven Drive. I've been back here before. It's just been a long time. I was back here several times when I was driving for Uber and Lyft and we're uh, right by the Cove where I've done videos from the Cove is uh, a block to our right right along the water where they had uh, some ships and little park area and there's a little convenience store there a nice street and it's still still pretty windy trees are moving pretty good and uh, I see flags and stuff waving they had the road closed up here so I had to make uh, a few little detours but now that I know how to get back here I wouldn't have uh, came the way that the app is telling me to Looks like it's going to be on the end of a little peninsula. He's getting his mail. It's a nice little road. It's actually a... Uh, look at this, guys. There's a hill on the... Turn way. right onto Woodcrest Drive. Then turn right onto Bayshore Drive. Got it. There's a, oh, puppy dog. <laughs> he didn't bark till I went by. I remember this road right along the water. Absolutely beautiful. Corpus Christi ship channels right out there. Seaside Beach Club. Dinner activities. Membership. Ooh. Let 
The water looks so In half a mile, turn left. Gotcha. You can see uh, Corpus Christi over on the left in the haze. Here comes the wind, guys, but you can see Corpus Christi way over there. Kind of. Must have some construction going on up here. Let me put the camera down for a moment and get through this group of cars. Maybe some type of uh, car club. You can see uh, Kiwit straight ahead. We went back in there just a few weeks ago with Craig. Craig. Greg. Jeez, Dennis. I got to message Greg and see how he's doing. Yeah, this is a nice street. I like it. Laid back. Little. Has that small town beach vibe. When I was driving for Uber, the last guy I drove back here picked him up up at, up at a bar and he was he was hammered and he was ready to fight someone and his friends took his keys away and <laughs> when I got him back to his house here he wanted me to turn invite. left then the destination is on your left thank you wanted to uh invite me in for dinner <laughs> I I declined I told him I was working Well, guys, looks like we found the marina, Bahia Marina. No public fishing. Ooh, that hurts. Birds are chirping. I'm sorry, guys, it's going to be windy. So I apologize already. Some nice boats. That boat is named Truly Blessed. From Lighthouse Point, Florida. Wow, all the way up here. And you can still see Kiwit in the back there. Nice motorcycle. That's a shame about the fishing because this looks like it would be a good spot. I wonder if that includes magnet fishing. boat ramp you got a little outdoor bar sitting area there so this is the sunset hideaway they have white claw here but don't hold that against them they have yingling in it as well they are closed today closed monday tuesday wednesday thursday five to eight friday and saturday they're open 11 to eight and sunday 12 to eight they are closed today. That's okay. They got a covered area out there for eating and drinking. Pretty nice. Water view. Another little picnic area. I bet it's nice back here at night when it's all lit up. And then they got some more boats over here. Very nice. Good find, Mike from Leander. <laughs> Thank you again, buddy. Mike's find, found me a quite a few good spots. So your record is intact, Mike. Definitely a place worth checking out. And it says they're on Facebook. If you want to check out their Facebook page. And the marina even has a, uh, a website. So I will try to remember to put that link in the description. There's a couple other things we can check out here. I love that sign, leaving Bahia Marina, entering the rest of the world. Very true. Notice this beautiful house going out. 
Very cool. Hey, what do you get when you cross a vampire and a snowman? That's an easy one. Frostbite. <laughs> Dad jokes. They have this uh, area right here, and I would imagine you could fish from there. I don't see any signs posted that tells you you can't. Speed bump. Pretty laid back through here. You guys, that was a really cool area. Mike, thank you again, buddy. I appreciate you. Thanks for riding along today, guys. Thanks for watching.